Hey, it's Thomas Mulready from CoolCleveland.com, and we are here today in front of City Hall and Public Hall for the kickoff of the 2012 Rock and Roll Hall of Fame induction ceremonies. We're here with Dave Gilbert. And you are the president of Positively Cleveland. Yes. It's, it's really the, the way we promote our, our region here. Tell me how you have been involved in this, because it's really been a citywide effort, has it not, uh, to, to do the, the induction ceremonies? Very much so. And as you know, the, the, the Rock Hall is making this not just one night like it is in New York, but really making it a large 10-day celebration for the community. And our organization, we are in charge of promoting Cleveland for travel and tourism. And this is a huge event to a, for two reasons. A, it'll bring in tens of thousands of people into the community for this event, but also gives us such a great opportunity to promote Cleveland to the world. Right. Two, last time the, the, the event was here in 2009, over $20 million in media right. was generated, positive media, for Cleveland all around the world. It'll be even bigger this time. That's on top of the economic uh, spend of people here. That's just the media representation. That's exactly right. Because so, the event itself is expected to bring in about $20 million. $20 million. And also economic impact, which is phenomenal. Right. Yeah. Talk about Cleveland area, Northeast Ohio, as a tourist destination, because we've been talking about it behind the scenes, if you will, for years. We that study it know that we've got the assets here, but it's been a tough sell until recently. It seems like we've crossed over a little bit, and now more and more people are starting to say, hey, wait a minute, it is the fourth largest industry here in this region, and maybe there is a reason for people to visit for tourists. There's no doubt about it. In fact, uh, last year, over over 13 million visitors came into Cuyahoga County for visits. This is not someone driving in to go to work. So it already, as you said, is a very large industry. But think, right now, over $2 billion in infrastructure is being built for the visitor industry. Both phases of the casino, the convention center, the medical market, over $200 million in private investment in hotels. People are putting their money on the table, believing in travel and tourism in Cleveland. What we need to do now is institutionalize it. How do we take advantage of all these shiny new toys that are being built so for years we feel the effect of this? That once the the, sh the you know the shininess is off the casino and the and the medical right. market, which will happen at some point, yeah. we're yeah. still uh, 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 seeing the residual and still seeing these additional billions of dollars flowing into the community. I'm asking this of everyone. What are you personally looking forward to this week? You probably have backstage passes to everything. What are you really looking forward to yourself that you're not going to miss? I have to say, seeing the Beastie Boys for me is going to be pretty <laughs> cool. But honestly, more than anything, when you see the, when you walk around downtown in a weekend like this, as you do every once in a while with a Final Four or other big events, yeah. there is a there is a feeling, there is a, a, a real specialty that... that is rare and you got you just have to walk around downtown and soak it in you know that's i was just going to say if you just go outside and feel the buzz it's yes. it's just buzzing it's, it's so palpable. great it, you can feel it very much so and that again there th this is one of those few times in a community like cleveland we're not new york or vegas it's one of the few times where the world is looking at cleveland yeah. it's going to be yeah. great it is dave thanks for your part in this nice. thanks for thank taking you. time to thanks talk thanks for all you do thank you Thomas Mulready from CoolCleveland.com here at the kickoff of the 2012 Rock and Roll Hall of Fame induction ceremonies.